To put it lightly, we've certainly seen some dumb things in this channel. Many of them have to be tied to a certain Linux distro, others have to be tied to really, really weird software. But even I, I of all people, was not ready for what I would describe as the most cursed issue ever made. This is... Oh no, Uwu, by Miku-chan03, because I guess Miku-chan01 and 02 were already taken. Let's just see what we're dealing with, but before that, I think we need to prepare. Racing Miku can just live here for the rest of the video. I'm going to try not to hit it, because I probably will, and then it will break. I am going to read this in the most serious way possible. Let's get started. Hello. Evwinyan. This is the solution for this issue right here. Watashi was also bothered by the fact that I couldn't log in any longer. So Watashi did some research and found this block of code here. Now you might notice this is not actually valid C code because they've uwuified the char as well in inputs.c. This doesn't work though because Stu Len doesn't count the twailing null. This is all skooey dooey. Name underscore simple isn't being terminated. And then, why I face? However, if we use the intended, stewed up, once again, uified C code, it works out nicely. It's a moo, stewy lin, kawaii, super dewy, funky, I don't even know what this says. I, I literally cannot translate that. This is my humble onagai. Bye bye, XO, XO. Heart emojis. I don't know about you, but if I was the one running this repo, I would get to about here and then delete the issue and ban this person from the repo. And some of the comments on this are kind of incredible. What precisely mentally caused this? Crushing loneliness and isolation. Now, this person assumed that this was the person who actually made the original issue. You should stop isolating yourself in that case. Clean your room. Touch glass. Not grass. Touch glass. See a therapist. Work on yourself and improve. And after all that nonsense, Miku-chan commented again. Don't worry, Junior Chani-kun. This is wheel code in LY that's causing failure when logging in. Honto. And then the developer even got involved as well. This was funny, but also painful to read. But it turns out that it actually was a legitimate issue. Ignoring the e code, it was a legitimate issue, and this did get fixed as a legitimate problem. Now you may be wondering, this is surely not the first time they've made an issue like this. Surely they've made other issues like this in the past, and this is just a recent example. Well... I went back through their entire history on GitHub. It's not that much stuff. They post like a couple of times a year. This is clearly an alt account. And I went back and checked every single issue they made. So you know what you're going to do? You are going to sit here and you are going to witness the absolute hellscape that is this person's GitHub. May 6th, 2018. This is when everything began. This is when their GitHub account was created, and at the same time, they also made their first issue as well. This was on a version of printf by MPA land, scary big unknown type uwu. And this is the exact same bit we saw in the issue from 2022. Hi! Using your kawaii printf implementation, the compiler gets all funny about silly size t, and it just does all of this nonsense. This fixy wixies the problem, xd, starts twerking. But the best part about it, right? The absolute best part about it is the dev took this 1 Hundred percent seriously. This is a zero joke situation. Maybe this person didn't know about Ubu and they assumed that like English was a second language for this person. But like, how is this the comment you get after this? The next comment after that is beautiful. What 
This is years later. Occasionally these threads make their way onto Reddit and people start to graffiti them. But this is not where it stops. This is just the beginning. So following this, they made another issue on this printf project as well. Once again, exact same bit, super serious comment. And the comments under it are just like, yo, what in the world is going on here? How is this happening? I do not understand. And then, and then it happened once again, this time on a completely different project. So unless this person has alts everywhere and they're developing every single one of these projects on every single one of these different accounts, for some reason, people are taking this seriously. Now you might think, ah, oh, okay, they edited. Maybe they wrote a completely normal one at the start and then edit the something ridiculous later. Now, for these older ones, the edit history is locked. I cannot see it. On this one, it's not. It's the exact same thing. It is exactly the same. This time, someone actually included a translation so you can understand what's actually going on here. And also again, it's a legitimate issue that ended up being fixed. And then again, this time over on another different project, this time on Blue Man. And at this point, I don't know what's going on. Someone says, what in the name of God? And I feel like I'm going absolutely insane here. Like how in the world, how in the world do you make this issue on four separate times, four separate occasions on three different projects with three different developers and every single time they take you completely seriously. I feel like I'm taking crazy pills. I feel like any rational person would ban this person from their repo. How? How is this happening? And not only are developers taking this seriously, some developers are defending this person. This is the person who made the commit and closed the issue. They say, Miku-chan03 identified an issue with signal bars when switching adapters. Next found the cause of the signal bars disappearing and pointed where to look. So thanks to Miku-chan03, I was able to quickly find the bug and fix it. I'm sure you see why I appreciate the contribution and we should thank Miku-chan03. I just don't know what's going on. Is it the power of Miku? Is it the power of Uwu? I don't know. I genuinely don't know. Maybe I've just been too involved in like actual serious projects like the Linux kernel and distro projects where people actually would get banned for doing things like this. Maybe regular people in the open source space, in the FOSS space, whatever you want to call it, just don't care that much. But I thought at least one person would. I think I just need to take a deep breath and calm down. Because it doesn't stop here. We are only in 2019. There's still a couple of years left until we get to the latest issue in 2022. Now, from here on, things get a little bit weird. For example, this is an issue on Signal Desktop, and this is a normal issue. Doesn't compile on Linux, no uberified code, no uberified output, just completely normal until they comment here, thank you so much, I cannot contain my happiness. Ew. But then, the next couple of issues completely breaks character. This one is on MDN, I feel like they actually would get rid of this person <laughs> if you were being meme like this on MDN. The next one, this is on CJSON. This is kind of trolly, but like, it's not the Uwu character. And then the next one is on MJSON, once again, completely serious, doesn't even have any like uwuified comments or anything like that. They've just completely broken character at this stage. But that doesn't mean the character just goes away. P U N E S, we're back in full force. But then it goes back to being completely serious. Now, once again, this is with MDN, so it leads me to believe they just don't want to be weird with MDN. But then. We're back to Uwu again. And then... It's German. I don't know where the German came from. I guess the author is German? I, I don't know. This is the one issue they've made in German. So... I assume so. <laughs> and then, on the 
XF86 Linux Wacom driver, the actual driver you are using if you are using any sort of Wacom tablet, they are half uwu We have the uwu title, allow negative pan scrolling speed, please uwu but like, they straight up just break character completely. I'm in a bit of a bad mood, I'll spare you the whole Miku-chan bit. They just want to make sure the issue gets out there and gets dealt with basically as quickly as possible in this case. But it wouldn't be Miku-chan without at least one, please, just one, just one, and then finally, one more issue before we get to the latest, and this is fully, fully back in character. So Senpai, I don't know how to say this. The Senpai's over at WGBDS, I'm guessing is a project, seem to have decided with the newest version of WGBDS to stop supporting the set command for wearables. As such, compiling the boot woms in the current form goes like this. <laughs> Error has been uwuified as well. Error. So Buku wants to humbly suggest putting this here. I don't know if this is like an actual uh, variable or if this is an uwuified variable at line 32 of this file because then it actually compiles. This is my humble onogai. Have a nice day. Bye bye. Best issue ever. Thank you kind senpai. And this also got marked as completed with this commit right here. Now, there's one thing that continues throughout all of this, and I think is a big part of the reason why this person isn't getting banned from repos. The vast majority of their issues are actually useful. Like, they're not trolley issues. They are reporting an actual problem that actual users are suffering from just in an uwuified way. If they were just joke issues, I could see them just being long gone by now. But they're not. They're not. They're completely legitimate things. And in some cases, they actually submitted the commits themselves to fix the problem. Nine out of the 15 issues were completely good issues. Only one of them was objectively trolly and probably shouldn't have been made. Miku-chan, if you're out there in the comment section, we need to hear from you. Please. I have... My Miku here, I will pray to the Miku to bring you into my comment section to hear what you have to say. So, that was certainly a GitHub user. Um, yeah. Someone sent this to me on my Discord, I was like, you know what? I have to look at this. If it was just the one issue, I would have ignored it. But because you have this long history... I just, I just had to talk about it. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Do you think this is cursed? Do you happen to be Miku-chan? Do you know Miku-chan? Do you know how I can get in contact with this person? I would love to know. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you like the video, go like the video. And if you really like the video and you want to become one over these amazing people over here, check out the Patreon, subscribe, silly bearer pay linked in the description down below. That's going to be it for me, and sayonara, see you later.